my attempt to start my move-in vlog. My car is literally like dangerously packed to the rim, okay? So what I'm doing now is waiting. So I still haven't got my lease or my keys or anything from the apartment. I'm supposed to be moving in tomorrow and possibly tonight, I'm not sure. So I'm still waiting to hear from them. So I think I've got like three more hours to hopefully hear from them. So, you know, just in that little waiting period. I am feeling very antsy and warm. It's very hot outside, um, but I'm super excited. It feels surreal to me that I'm about to have a place I can call home. I, it doesn't feel real because I've been needing this. I've been really, really needing this for a while. So this step will just, I feel like complete me and I will feel better when all my stuff is in one place because this is now my stuff is everywhere. everywhere. My brother's house, my parents' house, my car, and the people I live with, and everything is just everywhere. And I just want all my stuff in one place. And yeah, I am just, I I'm trying to pass time. I wanted to go ahead and hop on here and start this because I just want, like what to expect in this video is like, Today, like today's Sunday so maybe I'll start even moving in tonight I will start filming that and what kind of progress I make and then tomorrow is like moving day it's when I have the help with all the big stuff so expect a lot of that um there's a lot of stuff I want to show y'all that I couldn't show you in the apartment hall so expect a lot of that and just like it's gonna be cool just unboxing all my stuff and seeing what I have and definitely organizing putting stuff away many of those videos to come from this and the couch is being delivered tomorrow so that's really exciting that'll be in this video so i'm really excited to see the couch um i gotta go get tvs i gotta go get groceries so tons of things to look forward to in today's video but i just wanted to start with this vlog out and just tell you where i'm at right now in my mindset and I'm super grateful, but I'm very anxious and antsy and I want to be in my new home. So I hopefully, I will see you guys in the house. Um, I'm obviously going to film my apartment tour, which you'll have already seen before this video, but I'll probably film whenever I go in there for this vlog, but I will see you guys at my new apartment. I'm so excited. Hello everybody, it is 827 and I still don't have the keys to my apartment. Okay. But I'm here at Starbucks. I just met the sweetest, sweetest people from Wayfair at my apartment. And they delivered my a couch to the beep floor for me. So I was really excited about that. Um, yeah, they're awesome because they didn't have to do that. So this morning has been really stressful already because I had to like reschedule the couch delivery and think that I'm not gonna have my couch until Thursday. And then the guy called me, he was like, I'm 30 minutes away. And I was like, okay, I don't have the keys to my apartment. And he's like, well, just meet me over there. We'll figure it out. So we figured it out. It all worked out so perfectly. So I'm at Starbucks, my couch is over there at the apartment. So um, I'm a little worried. Um, still waiting on some paperwork. And then my, uh, I'm gonna go do the empty apartment tour. I should be getting my keys at nine. I'm gonna do the empty apartment tour. And then my family is gonna load up my stuff and head over and I'm gonna unload this car. Y'all, I can't even see, I can't even see out the passenger side. But um, I'm gonna unload this car and then um, go get another load from the house that I lived at and try to get that done before like 11 o'clock so I will let you know how that goes but yeah I'm so happy that the couch thing worked out because you don't even know the strain that's put on me so I and now I can lay mm, now I can lay on my couch and watch Reba tonight and that is all that matters so I'm about to get my coffee and then I'll see y'all soon
what you're doing fine cause you got me I don't wanna break your little bubble But you gotta wake up to reality Cause I can see in your eyes Your head is full of dreams Tears are a proof of failure Alright, so here is my update There's my mom and we got the couch in here. Everything's a really big mess right now. Um, we gotta get the mattress undone still. I've got the couch covered for safety. And then everything is just super messy, but look how cute this rug is. <laughs> That's me. And dad is in here putting the bed together, almost done. And everything fit perfect. Well, perfect. And then just stuff is everywhere, but this is the bathroom. And we just have stuff. Everything's unloaded. We just have like, I have one more load of stuff to get, but everything is unloaded. So that is good. But yeah, everything is a mess right now. So we're just going to quickly finish up. <laughs> anyway, you still be happy You can do whatever you like You don't have to be ready You just gotta trust the right You don't have to be scary You just gotta follow the light You're able to be happy You can do whatever you like Okay, so I did want to show y'all my air fryer. It's so beautiful. It's touchscreen from Walmart. And absolutely love this. And this is my knife set from Target that I just didn't want to take out of the packaging in the apartment haul. But it is super, super nice. I think I got it on sale. But this is one of the things I wanted to show y'all that I love. And then... So far, this is kind of like the decor setup, the Keurig, and then this is the toaster that matches the air fryer, and it's also touchscreen, so it's super cool as well. I can't wait to like test them out and see how they are. They really weren't that much more expensive than anything else, so I will let y'all know how these work for sure. All right, you guys, I look rough, but the first move-in day vlog is over. We got a lot done today. I'm so tired. I obviously get to film everything, so we've been working so hard. But we got the bar stools up. We got the couch. I'll show you all more later. And then the table. And this had broken pieces from Wayfair, so I have to call them. And then the TV I went out and bought and lugged up here was broken. So that is that. But the kitchen behind me very much put together all right and then you come in the bedroom and i still have to get more pillows in my debate cover tomorrow so then that'll be done um but yeah it actually turned out great in here um everything fit perfectly so look at the curtains and the mirror in there and then the bathroom let's see what we got oh yeah so yeah got all my stuff up and then this is my this is all the stuff I still have to go through tomorrow and go through my clothes and stuff 
but I'm just gonna go through all this tomorrow, no biggie. But I'm glad I can just shut it in there so I feel put together. I got that little shower stool from Wayfair. It's so nice. That's just gonna be perfect. And then I'm gonna hang that up there. And then there's this little mirror over here. I'm gonna hang right here. So these bar stools turn out to be perfect for this space. I got like a pack of four. And then I have this rug here. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it here because it doesn't match with the other rug, but you don't really see them at the same time. And then you come over here. And this is just my favorite rug in the kitchen. I think I'm gonna like scoot it down a little bit more so you can't see them both, but I don't know, it's kind of bothering me. But yeah, everything is so beautiful. This is literally everything I've dreamed of. This is everything I've ever dreamed of. This is all my stuff. Everything is so sweet, except for those mugs. Everything is just so perfect, I love it. So we got um, the washer and dryer is not even hooked up. So they have to come hook that up, but everybody just left and it's just me. And so I'm just soaking in the moments, probably gonna put some things together and just relax. before can't take this anymore cuz I've been looking for something to change thoughts into motion been waiting way too long oh, yeah waiting just for somebody to love and to surround me and to handle my emotions. okay so I'm about to start in the closet and just kind of like put things like where I need them. Like I'm gonna try to put the winter clothes up here because I really wanna like utilize this space because I mainly want it to be my office. So I have plenty of space in my drawers to put a lot of these clothes. And then whatever I won't be wearing, I'll put up here. And honestly, I need to get rid of a lot of this. So I'm gonna be donating a lot of this to Goodwill because yeah, I do not wear all these clothes. <laughs> Everything I wear, is in this dirty clothes basket so which i'm still waiting for my dryer to get fixed so i have to wash a lot of clothes to put stuff away in the drawers but i figured i would go ahead and hit record of me just starting to organize my closet Sometimes you get under my skin like a lover And sometimes you don't want 